Good morning, folks. Sunday morning here in the greenhouse. Thought I'd give you a little update on how things are growing. We got a mess of romas coming out of here. Nothing ripe yet, but they're all getting up in the big size. Roma's looking good. Maybe a permanent addition coming up soon. And there's our Geronimo's that slipped in on us. They're about six, six and a half feet tall. Over here, these are indigo rose. They don't have any any good sized tomatoes coming out yet. When they do, they, they turn dark purple where the sun hits them. They got an extra uh, supposedly antioxidant in them that gets dark when the sun hits them. It's pretty interesting. They're pretty good tomato. Not my favorite, but it's a good one. People like them. You see over on the other side there, the cucumbers are coming along. Got those strung up last week. They're getting tall. I think they've hooked in on the roots and uh, they ought to be growing real fast shortly. Won't be long, we'll be rolling in cucumbers too. Yay! You see the scaffold in the back. I was working on the jet fan tube up here. This thing circulates air. Somehow it just ripped open toward the fan. And I had to pull it down and turn it around because I can't afford one of these new ones right now. Ain't no telling what that thing costs. Probably 200 bucks. But those little clips, the plastic is kind of flimsy up there and it gets a lot of use and it rips out the plastic. It's real thin. It's probably two, three mil plastic and it doesn't hold up a whole lot. Although the two original over there, they must have built them a little better because they've been going for four years. These only made it about two. See the same thing on this side. It pulls down off that top wire. I don't know if you can see it. it connects up there, but anyway. It's one of the many things. You gotta be self-reliant when you got your own greenhouse because you don't want to pay somebody to come do this. They'll rack up the money on you. Another note of interest back here in the back. Papa Pepper sent me some Kiwano seeds. It's a cucumber type, melon, cucurbit, and those things are just giants, but I don't have any blossoms on them yet. Not sure what's going on. Might have got defective seeds, I don't know. I'm just playing. I'm sure they'll come along soon, but man, they are, they are bushing out. all 10 feet tall at least another one we got from Papa Pepper was these uh, garden beans and those are giants too but nothing on them a lot of times you get a plant that works good outside that uh, you put a little extra fertilizer on them and they put a lot of growth on but not a lot of fruit we'll see if that's the case here yeah, there's my there's my fixed job. I had to tie it off with some hay rope, hay twine. It should reach all the way back this way, but I had to cut that front end of it off. Anyway, and just one more thing. Getting over here on the Geronimo side. These things are looking good. Things tall, bushy, green, and there's tomatoes on them. Nothing ripe yet. I hope another two, three weeks some of the big ones down at the bottom will get up in there. I'll give you this view right down the, the center aisle. The jungle in here. see there's tomatoes all over just nothing big and nothing ripe yet maybe soon all right this one's going on about five minutes so let me these rose tomatoes on the next row 
those things are shooting up. So that means I got to get on that ladder next week. I'll give you the drone view, the overhead flyover. All right, people, I'll let you get back to it. I'm going to get back and get a little trimming done in here. Just thought I'd give you a heads up view on what's going on. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you later.